right, shout out Wam, shout out Wam. All right, uh, first and foremost, I right, love to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Mahashem, Yahweh Shai, Mahashem, Rukar, All right, we should say all praise to the Heavenly Father and His Son, whom the world ignorantly calls God, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Let us give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who rule well the true leaders of all earth on earth today, whether you can receive it or not. Much love, salutations to the Akim scattered across the four corners of the earth. Uh, uh, risking their lives, hazarding their lives to push this word, man. All right, rightly dividing the word of truth. And without further ado, we're going to get straight into it. All right, it's going to be like various topics, but I'm going to get straight into it. I got a scripture line that this is Jeremiah 28 and 7. It says, Nevertheless, hear thou now this word. So the Lord is telling our people, Look, man, here. Oh, mm -hmm. you know, come to mind, Romans 13 11. Now it's high time to wake out of sleep because mm -hmm. now is our salvation. Here we believe, man. We had the bitter end of the last days where you got earthquakes in diverse places. Over a thousand that hit Puerto Rico yeah. within the last year alone. Right. You got your coronavirus, norovirus, H5N1, uproars of the people. Okay, you got you got uh, hearing of wars, rumors of wars. Mm -hmm. All this shit's spiraling out of control, man. All right, so we're in that time period. All right, where our people need to wake up out this slumber that they're in, man. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna hold that on deck because I ain't, I ain't real. I, I, I kind of butchered it. So I'm gonna bring this back, but I'm gonna hold that on deck. Jeremiah 28 7. Nevertheless, hear thou now this word that I speak in thine ears and in the ears of all the people, the prophets that have been before me and before thee of old, prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence, man. Mm -hmm. All right, and we coming back again, standing in our light, like the scripture said about Daniel. In the end of the days, he's gonna come back standing in his light. We doing the same thing. Come back, tell him, look, uh, 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 pestilence, evil, and war is coming upon all these great kingdoms, man, from America to China. Mm -hmm. Did we not see in the day? Iran. Yeah, Iran. Did Saudi we, Arabia. Are we Italy. Not, yeah. Are we not seeing the, the? You make mention of Italy. Italy locking down cities over this coronavirus. Mm -hmm. All right, quarantining uh, fifty thousand. You said okay. Uh, the, the brother got an article right now about it hitting the states here in Ohio. Where we at, man? So, again, this now is not time to wake out of sleep. Yeah, I'm going to read it. It Go says ahead, Ohio now has 212 people under public health supervision for coronavirus. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So, hey, man, it's no longer a matter of, of if, but a matter of when, man. All right? And if you ain't got the covering of your how about she shot, you're going to be assed out out here, man. We've been telling y'all for years through the spirit of power. Uh, how about Shinyan Shah from our apostles and elders on down, man? What's about to transpire? And now it's here. Now it's at the doorstep. All right? Now you're going to know that a prophet was amongst you. Mm -hmm. you all right, so let me pull this up. Go ahead. All right, slide it, brother. You got it. You got it. All right, drop my precept. All right, right this, is, uh, this is Acts chapter uh, 13, verse 41. It huh. reads, Behold huh. ye despisers. And wonder and perish, huh. for I work a work in your days. And the main ones, if I can say this, who despise the word is, is two, thir two thirds of the Lord's people, man. And a, and a majority of that number is in Cleveland, Ohio, That's right, right. in the land huh. in where the, the coronavirus right. just landed. <laughs> and it's gonna land on y'all wicked ass. That's, that's right, right, that's right. You know that's I mean? right, that's coming. Because this that pestilence that walketh in darkness that you can't see, man. As mentioned in Psalms 91, you can't see when someone sneezed where that all those germ particles went. Yeah, if I you know can say this too, and the thing about it with this uh COVID 19 renamed the coronavirus renamed COVID 19, they said that uh it actually the incubation state uh uh slock it if i'm standing right the, the, the word incubate when it's um developing within you like something that's incubating matter mm -hmm. of fact look that word incubate up for me shot. because um a lot of these different um governments or officials or people that are um you know position of authority they telling like the citizen that you know they quarantining people for two weeks or 14 days mm -hmm. but they said that during the incubation period um, it could take up to 21 days before mm -hmm. people start showing symptoms. Mm -hmm. And then, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So imagine this. All these people that they send to the um, these, these quarantines, um, they do what? Um, they let them out in 14 days. Mm -hmm. But you got another week that that, that that person could actually still have the coronavirus exactly. and the symptoms not show up, man. Kind. So, is it so many words? This shit is spiraling out of control. Mm -hmm. All right, from Wuhan, China, you got stories of a Los Angeles flight attendant 
who got uh, the coronavirus in New York. There's recent talks today and now Ohio. They got a state of emergency in San Francisco. Right Even now. better, a state of fucking emergency, man. So here, it is spiraling out of control to the point where you can't stop it. This is the workmanship of your how about shit you on the side. Okay, oh, oh, you got it. Or incubate, yeah. it means have an infectious disease developing inside. Oh, yeah, right. So when the disease is coming. Huh. So right, That's when deep. the disease is developing, huh. they said the incubation period is really up to 21 days, but they tell the people only 14. 14. Mm -hmm. Dude, that's two weeks. 21 mm -hmm. days is three. Yeah, without having no symptoms, though. Without right? having no symptoms, mm -hmm. bro. So they tell you good, go back out there, go buy, go and sell, go still shop. infectious. And you still fucking You're still uh, contagious. You might be kissing your Just children. Just like the movie. You're not a germ spare with children. You can right. send them off the daycare. They come back sick. You can kiss your child, kiss your woman. Hey man, you spreading this shit, man. Just like the movie uh, Contagious. Exactly, and it's just so happened to be, from my understanding, the same disease with this, uh, the, the same, same general area. China, China, China. No, but I believe it's a disease that they never heard of. Disease they never, they they spread never spread from humans. From it spread from animals to humans, man. Right. That's why the Lord got uh, dietary laws and guidelines you're supposed to follow right. according to the commandments. But these heathens don't fear the Lord. You got it. Yeah, Acts, that back. Acts 13 and 41. Behold, ye despisers and wonder and perish. Yeah, behold, you despisers. Y'all despise the word. And wonder and perish. And that's what's coming, man. Y'all yeah. about to perish, man. I'm about to be slain by the Lord. You got that, my sword up? Come. Look that word wonder up real quick. It said wonder. Mm -hmm. like wonder of uh, Bao mm -hmm. Zhou. Mm -hmm. uh, G2296. It said to wonder at Marvel. Marvel, right. Come. Come. Yeah, because people are going to be amazed. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. It says, to be wondered at, to be had in admiration. Mm -hmm. Admiration. Yep. Huh. yep. And that's the time period we're living in, man, where people are, are in awe. They about to be standing in awe. Look, man, this is about to take the world by surprise, man. People out here trying to uh, uh, get their 401ks. They're trying to retire. They're trying to live their best life. This this is the Lord coming out of the fever tonight because they didn't suspect no disease to come out of nowhere. Mm -hmm. And they didn't even suspect the new year to kick off the way that it did. Right. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? They bring it in the new year, they drinking, they partying, they in that Bacchus spirit, that, that, that drunkard spirit, that drinking, you know, spirit. The Lord is coming to put a stop to everyday exactly. life. Man. Oh, that's that spirit. You gotta get it. That's the Isaiah 20, uh, what is it, 24 and 8, 24 and 7, that the mirth is is, is about to cease, man. The Lord is causing all the mirth in this place to fucking cease, man. All right, you about mm -hmm. to deal with reality, and the reality is this: the uh, evil is sent upon this place. A great day of tribulation is coming. The lack of bread is coming. The famine of the word, coronavirus, pestilence, diseases, man. All right, y'all gonna drink? Uh, uh, uh. He said they shall drink strong drink. They should be bitter than that drink. And if I can say this, two and three of the major things that our Lord and Savior how Shah said was gonna be happening when he come back is, is taking place on the planet Earth right now. You feel me? Oh, oh. Can I let that on you? Rumors of wars, Con. earthquakes in diverse places, and uh, the pestilence. And fires. Because fires, the sure. largest U.S. oil refinery is on oh, fire. Yeah, I forgot about, I forgot show, about it too, but I'm thinking about Isaiah 29 and 6 to land back off you, man. All right, that the Lord said he's going to visit this place, man, with fire, man, and it's here. Okay? You got mm -hmm. it. It's, I'm going to finish off on this Acts 13 to 41. It says, For I work a work in your days, a work which ye shall in no wise believe. No, a man declared it unto you. That's right. That's right. So then the work is the prophecies. That's, that's what right. the Lord working. He bring, he making it manifest. Mm -hmm. Because when you go into the word manifest, it means like to come on the scene. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the Lord making these prophecies come on the scene. That's right. Wicked Israelites. Because it's all I, I always go back to in that uh, second address. Score just for amendment. All of this is for correction of you Negroes, Latinos, and Indians. Man. What, what chapter verse that is? Second Ezra 16 and um I wanna say like around that's not right. Six, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, right around there. Because that's that is what the Lord is doing. He, he's intensifying these plays, man. Yeah, he, he said he's gonna work a work, and the work is the prophecies, man. You know? Which cause he said which and no no man shall believe. No man, man declared no. no, no man declared it to you. Right. Exactly. So what is we declaring it to them? Huh. Start with the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Huh. What does the word declare mean? To make publish. Mm -hmm. I so like it. To make public, to proclaim, okay, I got it. you know. Mm -hmm. So, what is we what 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 is we telling them about? 
The prophecies. the prophecies. So that's what the Lord gonna work. He say gonna work a work in your days, which in no wise you shall believe, though a man declare unto you. you. And we so, yeah. Right, the, the, the works of the prophecies, man. Yeah. That's beautiful because that's where Ezekiel 33 and 33 come into play. Then shall they know that a prophet has been among them. Right. Alright, All right. because everything that we're saying is coming to pass. Nothing we're saying right. is returned to the Lord void. Man. Yeah, because right, what we saying is, is not our words. Exactly. That's why it's not going you know, <laughs> it's not our words. It's that's right. Father, the, the, uh, through his beloved son, how it shall work, man. That's right. So you got it. Oh, was that it? Yeah, was that I, got, I, got, I got precept and also got that in second measures. Quick pre Psalms one nineteen and one twenty six. It is time for thee, Lord Jehovah, to work. Oh, so it's a lot. You know what else the Lord is working? What's that? The plagues. Well, of course, it's coronavirus, but one of the other plagues that I'm thinking about is what? The 400 billion motherfucking locusts kind of flying yeah. over there, tearing, that's a, that's a tearing right? up Saudi Arabia, yep. tearing up all the China. They're the going out of China, China bro. Yep. Why China got the coronavirus? That's right. The COVID 19. Bro, it's and, and, That's right. My brother just said that China's <laughs> one of the largest exporters to yeah. all these other countries of, Mainly of, America. of goods. Mainly it, America. America, uh, China is the number one exporter of goods to America. That's that's, that's that's how China got rich, man. A majority of these uh uh the uh, heathen countries, they they number one export that they export shit to is America. Like mm -hmm. like the apparels, clothes and shit, you uh -huh. know, with the dye, like the Indians do that. Uh -huh. the, the, uh, uh what is that? Elon. Elon yep. They they deal with dye that they that you dye your clothes with and all shit like this. They polluting the rivers over there, they destroy right. the the Lord said he gonna destroy them with destroy the earth. That's so right. they're about to destroy you, uh wicked Edomites, you wicked oh. heathens. You wicked two thirds of our people, uh -huh. man. They say why? For they have made void the law. Yeah, right. Yep. Cause they made void void the law, man. Yep. They made void the law. And you know. Oh, right. Cause and that man, go ahead, brother. You had some. Uh, I, uh, I, 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 I got. I got. I got. Oh yeah, you said that. So um, that like. I got that in second measures as well. I was thinking of right quick. Um, it's a scripture in Isaiah, like twenty six, I believe, or twenty four, that talk about you know, uh, uh, uh pretty much. This place, yeah, here it is. Uh, Isaiah 24. The foundations of the earth, right? Of course. Hey, that's 82 and 5 oh, songs. Like that's songs. I can get that too, Lord William. This is real fast. So, uh, Isaiah 24 and 4. The earth mourneth and fadeth away. The world languisheth and fadeth away. The mm. haughty people of the earth do languish. Mm -hmm. It says, The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. Mm -hmm. Because they have transgressed the laws, mm -hmm. changed the ordinance. Broken the everlasting covenant. Even going into what you was talking about as far as the fire of the earth. All yeah. right. Everything that you have done that's against the scripture. They're destroying the earth. That's why your how by Shimmy is working. Poison in the water, poison in exactly. the crop. Uh, the it, air. Another thing about India too, they like uh rice. They big on exporting rice if I ain't mistaken, mm -hmm. bro. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They big in um cultivating rice. Kind. You know what I'm saying? Kind. And I'm just giving a brief example of how these heathens pollute the water and the water like rivers that 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 um what's the what's the word I wanna use? Quench quench the thirst of these of you know uh -huh. of these different herbs and things like that, man. Mm -hmm. So these these heathens, man, the Lord about to spread their ass. Oh, I'm right. thinking of a scripture real quick, uh Obadiah 115. Uh, the day of the Lord is upon all the heathen. Yes, As thou hast done, yes. it shall be done yes. unto thee. That's right, that's right. So I love y'all about Shimei was shy, man, because the Lord is avenging himself. Uh, speedily on our adversary. And now that I said that scripture, it made me think about the brother Ty of the Earth was talking about all the Moabites getting attacked all mm -hmm. over the world. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, racial yeah, slurs. Yeah, yeah. 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 That, that's the, that's crazy, man. <laughs> all these Moabites so about Chinese people get attacked all over the world, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, call all y'all by Shimmy Al Ever since that coronavirus had hit, it's um, like you see a mall by everywhere now. Yep. Yeah. Now we be at Kelly just walking past. Yep. And, and that's all you think about. That's right. Hey, they even got <laughs> what's right. going on. They think, because you know, people try to make jokes out of this shit thinking things going to get better. Um, They got people making videos of them coughing in public just to get reactions out of people. Mm -hmm. on the cameras and mm -hmm. this shit's funny. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? This shit ain't though. It's going to be funny when it comes right yeah, to them. Yeah, when it comes right to them, man. You know, so I, I got... I got second, you hope so? Oh, yeah. Second measures 16 and 7, uh, I started 18. It says, the beginning of sorrows and great mornings. Yeah, right, because this is the beginning <laughs> of the two, Bracket Third. Right. This the beginning of sorrows and great mornings, man. Yep. You know? The beginning of famine and great yeah, death. Yeah, you know, sorrow, 
and great mourning because people are going to be losing, losing their loved ones, man. Just like in the movie Contagion. When, yeah. the, when the dude's wife died, yeah. then his, step, his stepson died, people was crying, man. People can, was mourning. Can you believe that cannibalism is coming back as well? So not only are they going to lose their child, they're not going to be buried. All right, there's going to be so much great death. But also, because like you was making mention of it, <laughs> Uh, how they uh they not burying them bodies? Yeah, they not buried because yeah, the lady, morgue. yeah, the lady yeah. in the morgue. They try to say she, they she seeing hundreds of bodies come in. They they ain't got no room to put them. They ain't got yeah, no room to so what they gonna start doing? Burning it up, incinerating them, right? Causing more diseases. It, more you know how? Because that 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 fumes or those that um that smoke from the burning of those bodies go go to the 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 clouds. Exactly. And, right 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 right. Right. and get everybody coming exactly. out and stuff. Exactly. <laughs> And that's why they got a cremation oven and, you know what I'm saying, and all that stuff. But, hey, man, this is the beginning of sorrows and great mourning, like it says here, the second under 16, 18. Yeah, it's just the beginning, right? Because yep. in America, you know what these people in the United States do. As soon as a so-called crisis, what they do, they go straight to the store, the gas station. So everybody about to be going to the gas yep. station. They about to be buying good canned goods. Yep. Real talk. Water. Because I was even gas, thinking about that gas shit. in abundance just to sit in cans to sit to the side of the table. I was even thinking about that shit because the um, is one doctor from the CDC, the Center of Disease Control. She said it ain't a, it ain't a question of. She said it ain't a question of when. It's a question of uh, uh, not uh, if not if no. the water. Not a question of if the coronavirus go be spread. I'm talking no. about spread in America. Yeah. They said, but when? Exactly. Ain't no if, man. Ain't they no said when that coming. shit gonna spread. They they, 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 they talking about late, bro, man. And, that, and and look what Esau do, man. He come out with a law or writing legislation. Why everybody worry about this? He gonna be writing legislation and um passing laws and shit, man. Like you was talking about with the beard situation. They want mm-hmm. to try to make us cut our beards because of this fucking coronavirus. Man. Yeah, try to they using that. That's why they said never um let a good crisis go to waste. waste. You feel me? Exactly. So yeah. what what is they gonna use with these crises though at mm-hmm. the end of the day? Now when you really think about it, they, they, what they gonna do is use it some to come up against us. Mm-hmm. Whatever crisis they starting to get from now on, they gonna try to use it to come against the uh the Israelites, bro. Right. Starting with the Prophet right. Elsa Great Millstone, man. That's right, that's right. That's mm-hmm. right. It says the beginning of uh, this is second Ezra sixteen eighteen, the beginning of sorrows and great mornings. Hey, did not the Lord say that in Matthew the 24 exactly, chapter? Exactly, exactly. That was just, that's the spirit you said that. Right, because the angel, about the pestilence. he yep. was telling uh, Ezra, yep. you know what I'm saying? He was telling him about a vision he was having. Yep. That's the spirit, man. I went right to it. That's the spirit called life. The angels is in, um, they are one court with Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai. But it's crazy because he was telling them that, man. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it real fast. Matthew 24 and 6. And ye shall hear of war mm-hmm. and rumors of war. That's one of the major prophecies yeah. that the Lord, and one of the signs and indications that the Lord was going to be coming back, that yep. he was going, when he was going to make his second coming. Yep. So there's going to be wars and rumors of wars. General Solomon got murked. Oh, yep. ooh, and then they're going to say, they going to say that this thing was like a disease warfare. Somebody going to come up with them type of accusations yep. and try to blame a certain country, man. Yep. And guess who else got sick? The deputy, the, the health Deputy Minister of Iran. I, I think I seen that. Yeah, huh? Bro, he's yeah, like, bro, yep. sick, bro. Yep. You feel me? So, so y'all watch me, I was shy. we hear the war, <laughs> Salaki, and, and rumors of wars with yep. that whole situation with Iran and America. Yep. You know it's, what I'm saying? Even though that shit ain't on the American media, they 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 uh downplay it, man. Yep, it's a media blackout. There we go, media blackout on it. It says, see, because he saw always black out the yeah, truth. That's yeah. what he always want to do. Yeah. He don't want the truth to be to come to the light. Yep. He want to he want to put a a dark cloud over the truth. Exactly. You feel me? So it's exactly. got a bad stigma that come with it. Exactly. The truth. You know what I'm saying? That's right. That's the truth right. is the truth. Hey, like even not to down not to digress. The S four hundred missile defense system. I was reading an article about it. How they tried to shame it and. Mm-hmm. Bad, so yeah. they, uh, allies don't get it. Mm-hmm. Um, but nevertheless, it says he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Mm-hmm. That is a part of the war because they tell tell it Ankara, which is Turkey, to don't get the S four hundred missile, get this picture. But they said on oh, RT News this morning that we don't have none again. Bro, you in the this spirit? Shit, this shit bugged you know out. Why? What now it's making me think about wars and rumors of wars again. It's exactly. an actual war going on right now exactly. against who? Somebody you just said. And you uh, made me think uh, about uh, it. Uh, you just said their names. <laughs> the Turks. <laughs> Turkey. But you they, they fighting ISIS. Syria. Syria and all them niggas. ISIS supporting these 
Oh, them niggas oh. smack you. They fighting against the they Syrians. They still in the Kurds. In the Kurds. Bro. Bro. Yeah. Which, in which America, <laughs> the elites is beyond all of them. Exactly. Right. They funding both sides, right? Hey, but look, you know what else? The apostle, I, he is the apostle elder, apostle elder Malcolm on uh-huh. GM in Chicago. He said that um, because when the scriptures talk about the Lord gonna use the least of the flocks and draw them out, uh-huh. he said that the Turks, bro, they really Amalekites, yeah, bro. Right. They they Amalekites, right? They just Amalekites. They from the same lineage, of course, but one of them Islam and the other ones on um, so-called Judaism. So, yeah. Ju- Judaism. Yeah. You feel me? That's yeah. that's what the difference is. Uh, uh, the Egyptians against the Egyptians. But the, the, it was crazy because you were like, that's a strong possibility that the Lord could be using the Turks. Yeah. To, they over in the belly yeah. Joseph, yeah. Fat, you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. And he go, death could be talking about them too. Exactly. Because yeah. they are part of the least of the flock. And when you think that's about true. it, they also define America's wishes, even though they're the same people. They define them. And that dude, uh, the president of Turkey, Recep I Erdogan, whatever his name, Tayyip, Reset Erdogan, he have a strong hatred for Benjamin Netanyahu, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You feel me? He used to always say, and I'm pretty sure he still had the same oh, sentiments, yeah. but he used to always say that, man, that because America always, um, like, you know, never, um, um, what, what's the word I want to use? Go against uh, Israel, if you will. Uh-huh. They were always saying that uh, America be giving Israel a pass, so to speak, and, and the Turks, they don't like that shit. Well, man. they do. They fund them billions annually. Every year. Bro, they the Turk, that dude, Tayyip Recep Erdogan, uh-huh. he be making mention of that shit. This for you. Matthew 24 and 6, and he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Yep. See that ye be not troubled, Mm-mm. for all these things must come to pass, mm-hmm. but the end is not yet. Yeah, right, because the end is going to come when the RFID microchip be made mandatory, uh-huh. and that be made required by law. So we close to the end, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We can see the finish line. That's right, that's right. That's why the scriptures say press towards the mark. Yeah, you know we can see the mark. That's the end goal. That's When you look it up, that's what it means. The end and goal we can see the, the mark them. spiritually and uh-huh. physically. That's right. That's the spirit that's right. I, on the yeah. Jewish post. It says, right, right. Turkey, Erdogan, yeah, who, he said he made a statement. He said, "Whoever is on Israel's side, we are against them." Exactly, yeah. bro. Call out y'all by shot. And that's the Lord dividing the house. The scripture said, "If the house be divided, it cannot stand." But half an in, right? And the, the the Turks, the Turkey, Turkey, those them uh, uh, Edomites over there in Turkey and the Edomites in Israel. You feel me? Huh. That's the Lord of what? They they house divided. Exactly. So it cannot stand but exactly. happen in. Because that's what happened to us. The house of Israel. You got, we got divided. You got Russia against America, the same people. You got fucking uh, the Turks thrown in there, the Israel which, which, thrown in there. Which, they all the same fucking people. Right, which you go back to their sons that uh huh. Esau had. That's right. That's right. Fast, that's right. Teaming. So that's you right. got these Temanites. Yeah, the, you know what I'm saying? Right. Child, if I'm mistaken. Yeah, that's right. right. But yeah, right. They have the same household. Yep. They have yep. the same household. That's right. right. That's right. That's Which the right. Lord is coming to divide households. Yep. He is. The it's Lord is there. That's right. right. Uh, it's Matthew 24 and 7. For nation shall rise against nation. Come. And the kingdom against nation. Which kingdom. that's going on. Exactly. That's one of the prophecies the Lord said. Hey, so we had a war. That's, that's a nation. Turkey. Nation. Oh, don't forget, India and Pakistan been trading blows too. They have not stopped either, man. Mm-hmm. All right, it's, it's oh, a lot more war. Saudi going Arabia on. and Yemen. Come, you feel me? Exactly. So it's a it's a lot of war that gets blacked out, man. It you is a lot of war. Too much about because, like the scripture talked about in Ezekiel, I believe thirty eight, how. You know, those that dwell here in Babylon, they dwell carelessly without walls, they at rest, so to speak. You don't think too much about it because it ain't affecting you directly. But when it affects you directly, that's when shit gonna hit home, man. And this coronavirus and these wars, all this shit about to hit home. So sedition, these uproars, this, uh, 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 like I say, for a nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. Right. Uh, all these uproars of the people, that's about to hit home soon. It says that there shall be famines and pestilences. Yeah, yep, and the, pay, and the famine is about to come soon because the scripture said that um, the storehouse shall suddenly become oh, empty. empty. And we know that the main yep. importer of these different goods is who? China and these other nations, man. America is not a real big producer. They can't keep up with the demand, the supply. Uh, uh, they can't pe- keep up with the demand of the people, man. That's right. People in, this, in America, they eat what? Motherfucking burgers, they eat all day. They eat all day. You feel me? Yeah. Drink all day. to go to sleep. You know, you know what and saying? you think that America is the one who producing this, these mills? No, they getting this shit shipped in, bro. Exactly. You feel me? All these fucking um, <laughs> cargo ships, you know man. I mean? You look for those McLean trucks, McLean. They be filling right. up all these different food dist- 
Matthew 24, they looking for it. They, they should, they, they, um, what would we do to get Matthew Come uh, Matthew 24, and if I may say this real quick, I don't know if you got the chance to see it. I put it in the group chat. There was a fight. The brother might pull it up in yeah, the, right. Italy mm -hmm. because of the lack of food, man. After they quarantined 50,000. Yep. So this is Matthew 24 and 7. For nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. Yep. And there shall be famines. Yeah, the famines is coming, man. The yep. famines is coming. Cause, 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 because of this COVID nineteen, the coronavirus. Yep. That's why these families, because all these different major exporters to America, they gonna cut that shit off. They gonna sever ties, and why? Because of what? Fear of getting yep. cut. But look, ain't nothing to fear no more. It's in Cleveland. It's here. It's in San Francisco. You feel me? New York City. New York. Texas. It's coronavirus it's Texas. here. All right. It says uh. And you know how filthy these people is in this society, man. Exactly. And you gotta understand too, a lot of people yeah, might think it's a common cold. A lot of people right, out right, here, right. This is regularly sick right you now. Right. And you know how Jake don't go to the doctor. Jake ain't got no. Jake like to sit down and say, "Oh, I just let it heal on his own." Mm -hmm. Jake probably affected with the coronavirus, just thinking this is a common cold. Yep, and don't yeah, know. cause that's some of the symptoms of a common cold. You feel me? Your throat scratchy, closing up, whatever. Like a uh, like an allergic reaction. Uh, what is it? Um, fever. That's you feel me? Scary. Coughing. Yeah, that's scary, man. Yeah. You hey, but guess what? Been going through, but we gotta trust the Lord, man. Guess what? Hey, cause uh, we if you got melanin, <laughs> you uh, look, the coronavirus is gonna have a hard time getting us. Just to be honest, cause we so <laughs> so like it. We superior, man. <laughs> hey, even two thirds, God, God, man. No, so, man. We hey, I wouldn't be surprised if all the motherfuckers in Cleveland that got it is eating by seed, man. I don't know what up. God, hey, you know what I'm saying? We, hey, through the mercies of the Lord, hey, we like the scriptures say, we shall fall into the hands of the Lord, man. Mm -hmm. So we keep in trust and faith in Him, man. Like right, I tell you, right. Deuteronomy 32 and 39, the Lord, the Lord, He He wounds and heals. All right, it's up to the Lord. As long as we please in Him, man, we hoping to fall to His good graces. Right, the, says, the Lord said that no, ain't, ain't no evil shall touch me. Right? You know what I'm saying? And, 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 oh, Job the fifth chapter, and, and, and destruction, and death, and famine. Job said, he's just he's reading about famine. Yeah. So I'm making right. you make a right. joke about this that's shit. That's right. The the, the, the meetings, they they two hundred motherfuckers that the brother just brought out. <laughs> I'm thinking of my brother the first chapter. Yeah. Like, uh oh. Uh, how do it go? It's like 25, 26, 27, Proverbs. You said that not, none of my reproof? I yeah, y'all gonna laugh when your destruction, destruction comes, right. man. That's how the Lord mocking through us, his right. people, his men, man. Okay. And, and we mocking you heathens, really, right? Well, I am. Because I'm excluding Jake for this particular <laughs> segment of this lesson. <laughs> you feel me? No, I'm going to get right back on him, though. Oh, God. <laughs> but I'm talking about those 200 people. God. All the people God. that's affected in America, bro. They got kind of Edomites. That's right. They, they affected in Ohio. In Ohio. That's 212 in Ohio. Yeah. God, why y'all about shit on shop, man? So like Elder Matthew said, it's about 5,400. And it's probably Chinese motherfuckers in nah. Ohio, because Ohio, nah. uh, they, look, it's probably some Chinese motherfuckers over here, man. That's right, man. Who was in China and uh, quarantined for 14 days during the incubation period, yep. hopped on a plane and came right over here. That's why Donald Trump said he was pissed because those, those infected people came over here on the regular airline without his permission. Yep. Then Donald Trump asked him for $2.5 billion to try to fight the coronavirus, mm -hmm. man. Easy. They, they ain't got the money, man. Y'all, y'all, this coronavirus got y'all in panic mode where the stock's down. Right. This shit is awesome. And the scriptures say oh, money can't deliver you exactly. in the time of the Lord's wrath, right, man. That's right. So that two point five billion dollars ain't gonna do no justice. Not a damn thing. That's going straight in this in this funds, man. All right. It says here in Matthew twenty four and seven, for nation shall rise against nation mm -hmm. and kingdom against kingdom, mm -hmm. and there shall be famines mm -hmm. and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse places. So earthquakes. You got, you got pestilences in diverse places mm -hmm. too. Famines and all that. Yemen, you may mention, they've been starving for years. The U.S. Mm -hmm. been starving and killing the niggas for years, man. Well, okay. people starving in America. Real talk. Homeless is, is at all time high. That's right. Okay, it's just going down. You got children starving in America right now, literally, bro. Hey, that's real, bro. Yeah. You got people that walk up to your gas station, children saying, can I just pump your gas? Right. Just because I'm and trying they to get them, they starving, they starving the inmates out in jail, man. You're right. They locking them up in the hole, man. Giving them a bologna sandwich and a day, it. and that's it. And, and a fruit, man. That's and that's it. that they that's very torture. thankful. That's a blessing. That's a blessing. This is verse eight. All that's all psychological, though. That's yeah. how Esau used. That's a part of his psychological warfare to break a nigga and make a nigga bow down to him and and 
act as if he need him. You know what I'm saying? That's what Esau, he want to be needed. We don't need you, Esau. No, that's right. You know what I'm saying? You got to accept the fact. That we yeah. don't need you. We need Yahweh Bashem and Yahweh Shai. We need, we need salvation. All right. It says, all these are the beginning of sorrows. And that's all built up off of, because we was reading in the second edges about the sorrows. I'm still holding it. Come. <laughs> You're right. That's how it be. Right. Second edges. Oh, let me finish this last verse. Matthew 24 and 9. Then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you. Yeah, right. Because if you got a beard and if you don't shave it off during this COVID-19, they're going to basically like make you an outcast. And, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cast your name out as evil like the scriptures yeah. say. You know what I'm saying? You know right. it. That's right. But what group of people going to refuse to cut their beard? Man of the Lord. Exactly. You know? That's it. That's, That's it. it. That's how they going to know who the Lord, who the true Lord, people of the Lord are. Man. That's Because Jake out there, they going to cut their shit. What? Cut it off, all right? Yeah. You know, Jake cut their shit off for a job, let alone. Yeah. You know? So, hey, at the end of the day, they going to know that it's the man of the Lord. That's man. right. And, I, and I'm going to say this. Unless they force Jake to cut their beard. Like, literally. Hold them down and yeah. cut their beard just like they did um, King David's men. And they shave half of their beards yeah, off and yeah, told the yeah, Terry yeah, of Jericho yeah, to yeah, grow back. Yeah, yeah. So, with that, man, you know, shit. That was against their will. Yeah, right. again, if it's against your will, shit, you know, the Lord have mercy on you, yeah. you know? It says, then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you. And, and like the uh, brother said, though, um, that that shit come from Egypt. That shit, that shaving, he said, that shit yeah. go back to Egypt. That's why, you know, this modern day Egypt. Now, because I'm sure if you look into um, going to Google, you know what I'm saying? Research it, you will come to that um uh, conclusion that that's where that shaving shit come from. Mm -hmm. That's why America, modern day Egypt, man. That's right. That's why they push all these shaving commercials, Gillette, so on yep. and so forth, man. All these Brain different commercials, man. Yep. It yep. says, then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted mm -hmm. and shall kill you, and you shall be hated of all nations for my name's sake. Mm -hmm. And that's the time we live in there where, yeah, yeah, they is hating us for the word we possess, for the word we preach because it's anti American. It's treason in their book. You know what I'm saying? Because Ooh, that's the spirit. Go ahead. I agree. Right. It says, uh, it says shaving predates history, but it, it was the man and woman of early Egypt there it who is. really established shaving and hair removal as a regular part. That's the spirit of yeah. daily grooming, a custom which continues today for people all over the world. There it is. The brother of Jim S. I hate my life too. The Alvin and uh, Atlanta camp, we mm -hmm. had put up a video today going into the beard about women tripping about them having to, you know, uh, get a law passed just for them to wear natural hair at their job. Like, I don't want to hear that, man. We, we losing actual jobs because our beard and us not wanting to color, man. Mm -hmm. can, he said, it's a million hairstyles in one. Y'all can do to switch that up to, you know, still get the job. If we don't cut our beards, we, we, lose, we, we throwing job positions away. That's money. That could have been in my pocket. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. at the end of the day, yeah, man, this is this is what's transpiring. Okay, and we're in that time. I got back in Second Ezra's chapter 16 mm -hmm. and and mm -hmm. kind, kind, 16 and um 16 will bring back 18. The beginning of sorrows and great mourners, the beginning of famine and great death, mm -hmm. the beginning of wars, and the power shall stand in fear, the beginning of evils. What shall I do when these evils shall come? Mm -hmm. That's what he was asking, man. Mm -hmm. We got to put our trust in how we shine. That's right. it. That's all we can do, man. We don't have no hope. We ain't got no